alert the milker has been found dead. What are you doing up there? What are you trying to milk? Are you trying to milk that bush dead? Welcome back to Zephonathel. Well, the game crashed. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I gotta redo all this stuff. So what we're gonna do is get more tombs going. We'll get slabs over here. We'll finish out these bedrooms. I am going to build a watchtower up here because we clearly have a problem with dwarves fighting stuff they're not equipped to fight. Let's clear all that out. I'm going to do something here. We're going to create a captain of the guard. Squad. Now, is there anybody that would like to join this squad? You're an adequate wrestler and a novice axe dwarf. Welcome to the captain of the guards squad. There we go. The oils of entanglement. Your job is to defend inside. Actually, I'm not even going to bother. Well, while my dwarfs get dead out there, I'm going to go ahead and build this uh, construction here. I have struck Tiger Eye. Ooh. We well, need to make a lot of beds. Because we have a lot of more bedrooms coming in. Oh, uh, there we go. We will change that number to... Let's go with... 40 beds. A vile force of darkness has arrived. What do we have this time? Here's what we're going to do. We're going to have all the dwarves go indoors. We'll repaint this. Unless I already have. <laughs> Very well, we are going to unpause this. Bring all the dwarves inside. And tell our squads to defend. Actually, I'm going to tell them to move. Very well, they will all move here to defend the gatehouse. All other dwarves get inside, please. Let's make sure they're actually set to do that. That is unpaused. Move quicker, dwarfs. Snatcher, protect the children. What are we dealing with here, actually? Let me take a look. A good amount of bowmen and thieves. Here they come. Defend yourselves. Snatcher got his ass beat. <laughs> we will defend our fort. Handily. What do we have? How many are left? They're just outside the walls. I see that they're shooting at my dwarves as they run in. Let's see if we go out to meet them. Shall we? Yes. Kill them all. Confirm. Get out there. Get to murking those bastards. Oh yeah, we've got quite the competent fighting force at this point. How many more are out there? Any more? I think that's it. I believe we have killed them all. Alright, we can turn off the burrows. Pause it again, pause it again. Cancel your orders. Oh, Dishmab Osterush, the Hammer Dwarf, has entered a martial trance. Let's see what he did. There we go. Let's look at the Hammer Dwarf. Oh, <laughs> kicked the goblin crossbowman in the right cheek through the left foot, and the injured part collapses. He bit the goblin bowman in the left hand, bruising them through their leather, latches on firmly. Hammer Dwarf shakes the goblin crossbowman around by the left hand. 
<laughs> the artery has been opened. Ooh. Very well. My friend, you are now... <laughs> Bashed him in the head. Jamming the skull through the brain and tearing the brain. Very well. You, my hammer dwarf, are the new champion of the fort. The schmub. There you go. You are now the hammer dwarf of the fort. Very good. We have to make more bliss arrows, apparently. How are we doing on that? Do we have them? Or are they done? Let's make some iron ballista arrows while we're at it. Alright, this floor looks like it's about done. Are there any more goblins out here? Like thieves? I don't believe so. I think we're good there. Overall, I think we're good. I think their snatchers came in and tried to take my stuff. And my dwarven children. We took care of them. Handily. Oh, we have a human caravan coming in. Very good. I know you want quivers, but I don't think I have those for you. Sorry. We'll see what you guys have. Can I get the broker here, please? Hopefully you'll... And Cap isn't dead. Well, I actually do have a few quivers. I don't think they're going to make much, but it'll get them what they wanted. Say a couple of copper crossbows and a copper bow. Probably from the goblins, I would assume. Let's move all that stuff up there and make the trade. Diplomacy. Greetings, noble dwarf. There is much to discuss. It's such a pleasant place you've carved out here for yourselves. There's much to share. Is there? A lot of movements happening up there. They're being attacked, it would seem. So are we. Is it down in the Dwarven territories? Hmm, okay. Well, interesting. Many more things we have to move a lot. Diplomacy. On behalf of the Merchant's Guild, let me extend... Greetings to your people. There is much to discuss. The world is the same as ever. What do we want? I'll take leather. Um, I'll take cloth. I will buy seeds from you. Muskmelon seeds, definitely. Um, where are the grape seeds at? There we go. Grape seeds. Done. They need powder. What in the hell is powder? Alright, I'm gonna assign a spot for my dwarves to go. Or do I actually have to like create a spot? I don't think so. I think you used to, but maybe you do. I don't know. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Okay, we can trade. How would you guys like? Copper crossbows, copper bow. Copper breastplates. Somehow I have a sheep wool shirt in there. I'll say all these bolts. And you know what you've been waiting for? Quivers. What's some mechanisms and some meals for the road? Alright, what am I looking for? We got water skins. Sure, I'll buy those off you. 4,000. Value. Thrapin. Interesting. You guys make a lot of friggin' instruments. Alright, I bought a whole bunch of seed bags. Lots and lots of seed bags. Oh, you got a lot of parchment and stuff. Can I buy... Ooh, a codex. Nice. I'll buy a bunch of your parchment sheets, if you don't mind. What do you even do with a cauldron? Huh. You got a lot of cheese. Apparently I can't buy all your cheese. Okay, um... I'll give you a good deal. You make a lot of money. Done. Keep them happy. Oh, we have a high master planter. I don't know what happened to Ancap. He kind of poofed. <laughs> Maybe he died. I don't know. I don't know. 
Oh, we got a Fisher Dwarf. Good. No real new good herbalists, man. We only have two. Grandmaster. At least we have a useful noble. Bone Carver is a novice stone cutter. You do that. No engravers, really. You're going to engrave stone there, Nish. Uh, for orderlies, we have another wound dresser. Metalworking. Oh, a novice weaponsmith. Nice. A furnace operator and a blacksmith. Very nice. Brewing. Why is it said to nobody does this? What the hell happened? <laughs> that could have been bad. Captain of the Guard, you may brew as well. Alright, where's my dedicated planter? Oh, he's chained. Oh, Rimtar, the Bone Doctor. What's going on there? Viol violation of a production order. Convicted. Yeah, okay. Oh, Rimtar is... Violator production order. Oops. <laughs> uh. Fifty-four days in prison for Rintar for violating the production order. Oops. <laughs> Twenty-nine days for you. The Axe Dwarf has no sentencing. Uh, disorderly conduct. You've already interviewed him. Can we convict? The Bone Doctor, sure. Uh, interrogate. Already interviewed him. Axe Dwarf, you were convicted of the crime of vandalism. Very good. We need to chop wood, apparently. We're going to do that right outside the gate. I don't want to go too far. All right, the trades of kindling. I want you to defend this. Start shooting those bastard birds. Protect our home. There we go. They have a duty to protect. Uh, we're going to look at them real quick, I think. What is your schedule? You guys are going to be in constant training. We're just always ready. Those are your permanent jobs. Congrats. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to build this gigantic friggin' dwarven drinking hall. I think over here somewhere. So I'm also going to build out my craft dwarves workshops over here. By the way, we're going to add to it. Really move all of our rock related stuff down here. I think that's a good idea. We'll get like three of these bastards going right there. Ooh, the dwarven child is taken by a fey mood. They have claimed a craftsdorf's workshop. You brought in a bauxite mug. Deer bone. Microline blocks. Rope reed cloth. And alpaca wool cloth. They are working furiously. Oh, Urist Libadast. What are you going to make, young one? Human Hammerman is fighting. Okay. Thanks for fighting for me. <laughs> Something has collapsed on the surface. Oh, yeah, a tree. Urist Libadast. Dwarven child has created... By Skatir, a deer bone buckler, she offers it to the fortification of grottos. Very nice. Somebody got knocked out out there. <laughs> well, don't make the tree fall on you, you dummy. The armor is stumbling around obliviously. Are you drunk? Are you a drunk dwarf? I mean, I, I mean that's a normal state, right? That's just what they do. Okay, let's go to... Stone workers, keep that. There we go. We'll get three crafts dwarfs workshop. Well, stone cutters workshops here. I think that'll be good. 
We'll keep the woodworking near the surface. I think that's a good idea. Who is this human crossbowman? Well, he's fighting here. That's okay. Let's make sure we actually have somebody manning this side. We have a tavern keeper. Good. A couple of performers who come around every once in a while. I'm going to build in a hatch here because I think it's done. Yep, there we go. Let's take a look at this buckler, shall we? If we can. This is a Deerbone Buckler. All craft dwarfship is of the highest quality. It is encrusted with rectangular microline cabochons. This object menaces with spikes of deer bone. On the item is an image of the study of dead suitors. The yellow zircon bound codex in rope reed. On the item is an image of a radiant cut gems in alpaca wool. Very interesting. Ah, uh, yes. So it begins once more again. We're gonna try. I think I'm gonna actually work on digging this out, but. Slowly over time, we're going to build this into the... Oh, God, we're in battle. Human crossbowman is fighting... Something way up there. What are you doing, weirdo? How's my tavern doing? Pretty good. There's a dead animal in there. Nice. Let's unforbid all that crap. All these corpses, if you will. Oh, God. The wilds are quite wild. Are you guys fighting? The milker is fighting. Yeah, there's a battle going on here. Human crossbowmen in this bush tent. Those things are just a big pain in my ass. So, I can hear the howls of the wolves. Why am I hearing so many wolfy boys? Are there a lot of wolfy boys out there? All I see are bush tits. The untamed wilds are a crazy place, my friends, if you haven't noticed. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start doing construction. We'll do floors. Do, 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 do. Okay, so we're building flooring all up here. Uh, and this will allow us to build matriculations over here. Start firing down heat on our enemies. I need to figure out the, the squad crap. It just wasn't working before, man. Okay, so you have to start a move, it would appear. Get your guard tower. Alright, protect the place, please. I think we can do pretty good with our defenses. Protect our little tavern here. Keep our people alive as much as we can. Slowly build out further down. You, Rimtar. Rimtar Saber Assault. Saber Assault? <laughs> uh, let's look at the... What was that screen? A new recenter location. Oh, for the function keys. What key was that? That was what? T. I. O. <laughs> I can't remember. I don't know what I hit. Whatever. Let's go to justice. Uh, we have closed cases. No cold cases. We have done it, man. We've gotten through it. Well, good to know. Well, I'm going to go through the cages and we'll see what we got. We have an iron cage. There we go. We're going to update this one. Paint it back here. Alert! The milker has been found dead. What are you doing up there? What are you trying to milk? Are you trying to milk that bush dead? I don't know what you dwarfs are doing, but it's annoying. Stop doing it. Stop getting dead. Alright, well, we have buried quite a few dwarves at this point. Quite a few. We're getting there, though. Still cannot export rings. Okay, that's fine. How are we doing on the new tavern? We've got doors. <laughs> this is already dug out. We're just trying to smooth all of this. How are we doing on tables? 
So the idea is I want this to be an open area for the dancing and the performing. And then I think in here, what I want is... Hmm... There's just battle going on. I'm trying to design this damn thing. Okay, we'll deal with that later. Not a priority. Got our craft stores workshops down here. Or stone workers, rather. I'm going to start dumping those. Okay, you can get removed. Bye-bye. You can also get removed. Bye-bye. Who is in battle? The wrestler is in battle. Steel mace. You should be doing pretty good against that thing, right? I would think. Oh, I feel like he's winning. He's exhausted, but he is winning. What a friggin'... What a fort. <laughs> what a fort. Is there a battle going on in here? It looks like it. Oh no, it's bush tip blood. I see. Here's what I'm gonna do. The Cyclops. A gargly roll has come. A giant humanoid monster with a single eye set in its forehead. Very well. We are gonna send everybody into the burrows. Let's make sure everybody is assigned to this. If they're not, they must be. Unpause, please. Alright, let's look at this big bastard. Others, where is this giant cyclops? An uninvited guest. The old climax of silver. Okay. Hundred years old. He's got he's slow to anger, good analytical ability. He's hopeful. Low willpower. Poor kinesthetic sense. She is annoyed while caught in the rain. I don't see any gear, no health problems. She has a great analytical abilities and a great deal of patience, but she has bad intuition, a poor kinesthetic sense, and a large deficit of willpower. She never becomes angry. Well then why is she over here? I don't want to fight you. Well, she's an enemy of many places. Okay, well, what we're going to do... Let's go back to our burrows. We will have you and you... Defend and just move here. Right? I can't do that? <laughs> I don't get what the problem is. Anyways, we're gonna defend these. Let us follow the big bastard. In they come, we shall do battle. The battle dwarfs shall hold. Are you gonna come through or just walk through? Making a beeline for us. Dwarf, ghost variety, fight them. Where's the rest of your squad? Are they on their way? Alright, I need you to move here. Thank you. I guess it was because I was in uh, patrol mode. Uh, fishery worker has been found dead. Did you just get crushed by that thing? Yikes. Where's the fishery worker? He punched him in the right hand, bruising the fat. Dude, he fought valiantly. But he got kicked. And it exploded. Don't get kicked by that thing. Get up here, dwarves. We must do battle. You must defend us. Well. The Mark's dwarves are doing their thing. Is he fighting the kitty? Are the kitties fighting for us? Are they protecting us? 
Where is this big bastard? Let me see what's going on here. Yeah, the cats are fighting. The cat misses the Cyclops. The cats are defending the fort. The fishery worker punches the Cyclops. Yeah, we already got that. Uh, cat bites the Cyclops in, Cyclops in the head. They are distracting him. He vomits. The flying iron bolt strikes the Cyclops in the right upper leg, fracturing the bone. We might actually win this. We might actually win this. What are you doing, Woodcrafter? We're just flinging all kinds of bolts his way. Very well. Engage in battle, please. Yeah. We hacked him down pretty, pretty handily. Armor is depressed. Very good. Very good. All right. Cancel orders. Right. That's that button. There we go. Well, let's see what the battle tells us. Who got the killing blow? The sword dwarf stabs the cyclops in the head with the iron short sword, tearing apart the muscle and chipping the skull and tearing the brain. Well, that would do it. The wrestler stabs the cyclops in the head with the iron spear. Nice. We have killed the great, terrible beast. Bring their bones back into the base. The fort, if you will. Good job, cats. Man. Very good. A huge, a giant humanoid monster with a single eye and its forehead. Yeah, a more. Well, very well. We have done, we have done good. The battle was joined. Fired so many bolts at him. <laughs> what are we in battle with now? Oh, a bush did. Okay. Well, Katie, eat the bush dead. You've gained skill in battle. You should be fine. Uh, we gotta turn off the burrows, don't we? Pause. Okay, done. Well, we can officially defend ourselves quite well. Apparently we're sparring. Okay, I need to build more tombs, obviously. Oh my god, so many bush tits that we're fighting. Wrestler is fighting them. Peasant punched it in the right hand. Wait a minute, it's a bush tit. It, oh, with his right hand. Right in the head. Nice. I like it. I'm a fan. And so we passed into the first of limestone in early autumn on the year 105. Oh, the wilds are calling it again. Oh, the mountain homes have sent their caravan. I don't remember what they want. Oh yeah, I do remember what place wanted a actual worshipping site. It was... Can I change this? Alright, we're going to change this to a new temple and that was to the Ruthless Creed. There we go. That will satisfy their desires. Apparently I need a door here. Do we have one? No. Of course not. Why would we? Well, I can get one more. Two more tombs, actually. Painted. Okay. Now we're talking, we can actually bury some of these people. Two more at least. You weaver. Of the Randy variety. Uh, who else wants to be buried? Gem setter, enjoy. We're gonna get more tombs set up here pretty soon. Should be good. Oh, you lost your altar. <laughs> I guess that just disappeared when I... Okay. All right. They have arrived. Let's move goods. What do we want to sell you guys? What do you want to buy from me anyways? Sort by value. Let's do that. Why am I doing it the other way? Oh, I have some silver bolts and copper bolts and iron arrows. I'll sell you arrows because I don't really use them. 
about that. An iron breastplate. I will keep that for now. I need my barrels. I ain't giving you nothing. I have a lot of beds. I okay, I have a bunch of those too. We have some cages. I gotta install most of those though. Codices. What can I sell you that I actually have that I want to give up? How about these tourmalines? I'll sell you some gems. I think they wanted prepared meals if I remember right. I think so. And I have a lot of those. How about all these? And... What else? Sell you some spinach leaf roasts. Some of these. I have a stupid amount of food. I think that'll do. I think that'll do. Broker, please. Go to the trading depot. Why are we leaving this fellow? I'm confused. <laughs> okay. Whatever. You do you. We got a drunk dwarf. Go figure. Okay. Broker, stop eating. Get up here and do the trade, buddy. Uh, thank you. You're not here yet. Alright, that's it. Anybody get over here. There we go, broker. Now, now I broke your little oodle loop. Let us trade. Alright, I'm going to sell you all the crap that I have. You wanted prepared meals. I'm pretty sure that satisfies what you wanted. Uh, what do I want from you? Seeds always. I'll take those for sure. You donkeys. I probably need to make more armor. Go through all that crap. Uh, what do you have? A bunch of seeds. I'll take all of those seeds. All those bags at least. I'll take your leather. Wolverine leather. Some bug bent leather. Nice. Do you have any codices? I want to fill out my library. Oh, good. You got cheese. Um. Yes. Give me all those scrolls, damn it. I'll take those codices. Hmm. Uh. We're close. I just need to chop down some of this. I want all the parchment. I want to get somebody. There we go. Trade. Done. Nice. Very nice. What is this? A statue of, of a swan man. Like, why do I have to collect like five way deep in there to do that? An image of Moldath. Rigoth. Rigoth. Zimkil. This guy's leaving his shoes on the bed. Rude. I think we're getting there on these. I think we'll be okay. Oh, we have a human crossbowman and a hammer dwarf visiting. I bet they're at the tavern. Just a hunch. Why, well, yes, they are. How are we doing here? Do we actually have people that are maining this site? We do. We have a tavern keeper. Keep it up, buddy. Where is the outpost liaison? Just hanging out? Okay. Apparently you have nothing for me. Oh, we have battle with the human crossbowman. Or something. The alpaca is fighting. Take care of that damn out. Good job. My archers are doing well. I think if I get a good patrol rod on here, I think we'll be good to go. I think what I'm going to do when I get the opportunity, oh look at that, we're smoothing this place out nicely. I'm going to build a stockpile for the dead here. Perhaps. 
remove it from up top. We'll have a garbage dump down here too. What? Caravan has arrived. Wagons. Fisher Dwarf has been found dead. Uh, that's not what I said. Resume the construction though. Why are those paused? Where are you at, Fisher Dwarf? Oh, you died in there. Let's look at my labor tab. Do we have a problem with people not laboring? I think we're doing okay on the planting. I'm not that worried about it. Uh, Fisher Dwarfs. Stone cutters were fine on. We have two engravers and they're not very good at. Everybody does hauling orderly stuff. We've got orderlies that can do it. Brewing we're good on. Overall, I think we're good. Struck hematite, very nice. Well, we're going to dig this out, create another little guild hall, I think. We'll see. We'll see. Hey, we have migrants that have arrived. They brought with them a horse. Uh, let's look at our dwarves then. Who are the new arrivals? We've got a clothier, a glazer, a leather worker, a planter, a tanner, a wood burner. Okay. Well, let's look at labor then. We do not have any new miners. We have no new woodcutters. No new archers. We have a talented planter. You're going to do that. Congrats. Um, no fishing. I'm going to take you off of plant gathering there, Lebrum. An expert stone cutter while well, you're doing that then, buddy. No new orderlies. We have a novice blacksmith who is also a tanner. I think Lobrum we're going to turn into the new... New Ancap <laughs> at some point. Um, okay. I think they do pretty good up here, but they'll do better with more coverage out there. Alright, I need to chop more wood. Oh, they're already doing it. Good job. Looks like I need to get more helms. Diplomacy, finally you wanted to talk. What do you got for me, buddy? You continue to impress. I have come empowered to elevate this land in the eyes of our realm. There is much to share. What do I want? Well, I want your... Seeds. Actually, give me your quivers. I'll sell them to the humans. <laughs> I'll take your glass while I'm at it. I'll take all your sand so I can make my own glass. Yeah, I think that'll work pretty good. I don't think I really have any clay, but maybe I do. Done. They want cheese and drinks. I don't know that I make cheese, but I can make drinks. That's for sure. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to dig back here. I'm going to turn this into a dumping zone for corpses. That way... It trickles down, not up. I'm going to do some auto mining while I'm at it. Dig down. Dig what we can. Get all the cool stuff. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff down here that I've, I've been working on. I see. Somebody's been carting that crap around. Well, this is as deep as I've gone so far. We'll eventually have to dig down further because we're pretty high elevation, if you haven't noticed. We're still technically above sea level. We 
good job, miner boy. Okay, well, I'm going to start building this out. So I think what I'm going to do... Hmm. We'll do something like this. All right, here's what I'm going to do. We're going to make this a meeting hall, right? Yeah. And we'll make this a new inn slash tavern. We'll go to this. This will be for citizens and long-term residents only. We'll have... I mean, you're already a tavern keeper, the Stukos. We'll make our wood burner be our primary tavern keeper. Who wants to be a... You're an accomplished musician. We'll welcome up your bard. Who else do we have that can do this? Go get good at that. Great. The tummies of channeling. <laughs> yeah, channeling that booze right into your belly. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and add a few chests. And by a few, I mean one. Okay, we need to make more chests. Can we make it out of rock? I don't think we can. Forge some iron chests. Alright, cool. We're actually getting somewhere. This is done. We're going to make a... Hmm. What do we need? We need a dump. I think that's it, right? Yeah, I think we want this as the garbage dump. Except... No, it's a corpse stockpile. I don't want that then as a dump then. What am I doing? Okay. Uh, let's go here. I guess you just make this as a stockpile. Okay. Okay. It's been a while since I made one of these. <laughs> okay. Corpses go down here. Give me a door. Here. It's making out of brimstone. We have a drunk dwarf. Okay. You've been reelected as... Oh, it's a duchy. I thought it already was. No, maybe not. I think a duke is the one of the highest ones you can get. Cool. We're getting better. Do we get more? We need a bookkeeper, apparently. We don't have one. Who wants to be a bookkeeper? How about... You weaver. Get on it. Okay, we need to assign you. Where is my bookkeeper? Boom, there you go. Um, yep, yeah, okay. Hammer already has a place, good. Okay, I feel like I should move my tomb down here. Or at least build a new one. That we can add two. So what I'm going to do is I'll go two wide. Oh, no, all. I'm going to work around this thing. Then we're going to line this with tombs as we go. All right, that'll be a good start. And I think we can do good with the rock coffins. Where are they at? We still got two more to do. Nice. Okay, I think what we need to do is maybe reduce this one down a little bit. Put a finished goods one here. I don't know. I probably need to clean this all up. Another drunk dwarf. Oh, Stark raving mad. Oh no, is it my leader? No? Okay. We have a scholar working here. We have a scribe. We have eight written objects. 
Hmm. We have zero writing materials. Do I have to make a quill? I always forget. Well, that's going to be another thing I'll work on later. Okay, good. We're actually getting somewhere here. Uh, we have two coffins we can throw in here. Nice. We kind of think of this as like the mausoleum. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to the stockpile. I'm going to repaint it. I'm going to dump it, actually. I'm going to paint a nice little stockpile here. It'll be for stone. Boom. We'll do another stockpile right here. For finished goods. Or is that furniture? I always forget. Let's do custom. We'll do furniture. Let's do none. We will toggle all of that. Finished goods out of stone. All. I think that'll do. That's mainly what I'm going for. So that way they don't have to go very far, really. That's the idea, anyways. We are going to bury all of our dead dwarves. The honored dead. Oh, we have goblin dancers in the tavern. That's potentially bad. Maybe. I don't know, but that's interesting a lot going on in this tavern. Should be fun. I need more wood, apparently. Get out there and chop down those dirty elf trees. Probably gonna agitate a few, few birds. Where did that dwarf go? <laughs> Is that a ghost? That might be a ghostly dwarf. I've made a soap makers. We need oil and tallow. Uh, we don't need to get a good wood, a good place for uh, working all those animal bits. Let's look at adding to our squads, shall we? What do we have for uh, Mark's dwarves? We have old Ancap the planter out there. Maybe I should make them the uh, tavern keeper for down below. Okay, there's nothing for archers. How are we doing here? We have one position open. Skilled swords dwarf. All right. Uh, I don't want the broker doing that just so he doesn't end up in that weird loop. We have nobody. Peasant. Sarvesh, you're joining the militia. Enjoy. Uh, use guys on the, on the guard. You will guard. Keep it up. A vile force of darkness has arrived. What are we dealing with? All right, dwarves, we need to get back into the castle. We have noobs that are not in that burrow. That is true. All right, get back in there, please. Let's make sure it's actually set up before I go nuts. Wow, I chased a vein way up there, didn't I? Interesting. Okay, this is good enough. 
It is on pause. Everybody should be getting inside. All right, you two. Get up here. You just keep patrolling that round. Shoot the... Shoot those bastards. Defend this position. We have an alert. Snatchers. What is this siege looking like? Okay, it's a more sizable one than we have seen before, but I think we can still handle it. Get inside, dwarves. Get them. Kill those snatchers. Looks like we're going to fight outside the walls. The battle is joined. Nicely done. Well, well done flanking those bastards. I believe our armor has protected us yet again. I think the siege is over. We have broken the siege. We are in the middle of winter. Well, in the beginning of winter anyways. The recruit has been found dead. Well, he was... Let's see how he, how he did in battle, shall we? You, what killed you? The recruit bites the goblin bowman in the head, tearing apart the muscle. He fought bravely, I will give him that. He did well. Shakes the goblin crossbowman around by the head. Recruit shakes the goblin. So he got shot somewhere in the spine, it looks like, and he pulled it out and dropped it, and then died. What a way to go. What a way to go. We need a better hospital at this point. All right, folks. Do we have any more of those snatchers out there? I think we're good. These goblins didn't fight me. That's interesting. <laughs> well, all right, folks. I think that's probably gonna do it. You can cancel your orders. Go about your day, please. Well done defending the fort. There is many drink for you below. We need more slabs. Far more. But we'll do it, man. We'll do it. We're getting there. Okay, folks. Well, I'm going to turn off the burrow. It is paused. Everybody can go about their day yet again. Yikes. Look at this battle. Chopped off his ear. I'll take all their stuff and their corpses. Well done. Well done, dwarves. Well, we have defended another siege. I think in the next episode, we're going to go raid their own, their place. We have a fairly good force. Two martial trances with Rimtar and Atir. I'm kind of curious, actually. Rimtar was chopping off stuff. Oh, we got, where did he get a steel sword? <laughs> I don't think I made one of those. Oh, man. Dude, he was just gutting these fools. Well, all right, folks. Thanks for joining me. Take it easy, and we'll raid the goblins next time. Bye-bye.